Hi everyone, this is Debbie Bornholt with Common Sense Landlording. Anyone that knows me knows that I have a tenant free screening system that I swear by. One of the problems that I have, and it's not really a problem, uh, but I have a lot of landlords contact me and say, hey Debbie, I'm not getting a lot of responses on my pre-screening form. I'm sending them out and people aren't responding. And this is not actually a problem because part of the goal of pre-screening is to have these people screen themselves out so that you don't have to contact them. Put your pre-screening guidelines on there. If you have an income requirement, credit requirements, rental history requirements, whatever your requirements are, put them on your pre-screening form and this allows these people to screen themselves out. If they see that their income is not right or they don't have the required job history or whatever your requirements are, that's a good thing. So understand this is a numbers game. And if you are using a platform like Zillow, your property is going to be seen by a lot of what I call tire kickers. And most of them are not going to qualify. They're not going to meet your guidelines. So don't stress out over the fact that not everyone is filling out your pre-screening form, okay? That's actually not a bad thing. It's a numbers game. Keep sending it out and follow up with these people if you need to. But what you're going to find is that the vast majority of them will tell you, well, I read the pre-screening criteria and I just didn't qualify. So for more tips on how to be a great landlord, be sure and join my Common Sense Landlording Facebook group.